with you. Uh, what are the sustainability efforts of the chemical cluster? Well, the chemical industry in Belgium is leading the way towards sustainability. The chemical industry is not only producing in a sustainable way, but we are also developing uh, innovative products which will help to uh, sustainable solutions uh, for global mega challenges uh, like water, energy, uh, climate change, natural resources uh, and so on. Uh, so therefore we are pleading for as industry for binding and global uh, climate change agreements uh, because it's really important that we can create a level playing field uh, where also other continents do the same effort as Europe. Huh? We are one of the most energy efficient uh, chemical industries here in Europe and therefore it is important that also other continents do the same effort in, in climate change and in decreasing CO2 emissions. Hi Nico, nice to good to meet you. How does the port support sustainability projects such as the Ecluse project? Well first let me give me let me give you some background on the port. In the port we host the biggest petrochemical cluster in Europe and one of the biggest in the world. There's in total 50 companies in that cluster. As the port authority we actually play a role which is twofold. We actively try and get those companies to work together with mm -hmm. specific focus on sustainability related projects. So we've recently constructed a wind farm which actually today for example provides nearly all of the electricity a big company like Borealis needs. Second example is that we try and get the companies to work together by identifying synergies between their product streams. What for some companies is a rest stream they can't sell, use that rest stream as feedstock to produce valuable products of, and we succeed in doing so quite often. What does a chemical company understand under sustainability? And could you link it with We Create Chemistry? What we want to do is to find products, solutions that help um, society to become uh, more and more sustainable. If we think about um, energy and climate and the uh, raw material change, um, what we try to do is, for example, produce materials that can be used to um, help build more efficient wind power installations. What are BASF's expectations of the climate conference in Paris and when will it be considered a success for you and for the industry? We work on many uh, technologies, many other companies, as industry sectors do. So if we find a common understanding that uh, we can deliver um, and that we only need to work on solutions technology and that we also maybe need to find uh, more acceptance um, in societies for new technologies that would be already probably overall the major breakthrough. Hi, nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. So BISF is a mega player in the Antwerp cluster and the best practice. Could you explain this? Yes, in uh, 2014, BSF has celebrated his anniversary uh, of 50 years of production here at our site in Antwerp. And in that period of 50 years, we have become second biggest Verbund site uh, of the BSF group. That's the key uh, factor of our operational excellence in, in our production activities. Verbund philosophy, that starts with uh, product integration, our production Verbund. And uh, not only the production for Bundes is important, also other uh, aspects from integrity are important, like log logistic integration that we have among uh, the different production facilities on site, the integration on environmental protection. Uh, we also have the energy integration, very important aspect in our Verbund philosophy. And last but not least, also the knowledge uh, sharing that we have among our employees here on site.